Hi, this is Peter, and I'm going to show you how to use our vacuum syringe to prime your continuous ink system. When you receive your continuous ink systems, sometimes um, you'll receive an airline, such as this right here. You see, there's a, c a considerable amount of um, air bubbles in this line, so which can um, hinder your, the performance of your CIS system. So, in order for you to do that, and if you you need to prime your system. And if you happen to have a vacuum syringe such as this one, uh, it's um, it will be it will help you out uh, tremendous, tremendously as far as it comes down to priming a system. Uh, how this vacuum syringe works is when I draw the the plunger out, it's gonna go ahead and draw air in through this way. But when I push it back out, it's gonna shoot the air. It push the air out through, through through an exhaust from a different um, hole and that's going to help us um, prime our system so by inspecting first inspect your CIS system see which color you need to uh, prime first um, by looking at here it looks like I have to prime one of the blacks right now so I'm gonna go ahead and do that uh, make sure you have some napkins in handy too as well I'm gonna go ahead and first take out the big plunger for the CIS system. I'm just gonna go ahead and wipe down the this area so it's clean when I insert my vacuum syringe. Okay, I was clean enough. So I'm gonna go ahead and insert my vacuum syringe on top, right here. I have to hold it with um, the one hand. Just so it there's a airtight seal right here, so when I start extracting the the plunger, be no problem. If you zoom in on this air um, this ink reservoir right here, you're gonna see some bubbles pop up, bubble up as I do this. See that bubble? That's actually the the air bubbles from the line popping out. So I'm gonna go ahead and extract push the plunger back down and extract more air you're gonna see more bubbles pop up right here watch see those air bubbles it's coming out to the top I'm gonna keep doing that one more time see the air bubble and go ahead and pop it out be careful when you remove this vacuum syringe because right now there's pressure built up into the system right now so you would just carefully Expose a little air gap so air could go back into the system like that. So I'm gonna go ahead and clean this up. As you can see from the CIS system, it actually pulled all the air bubbles so it could allow it to escape and it shot ink into the whole whole line. So as you can see from the line, um, for this black line right here, it's all full and it's all primed the black cartridge and the black cartridge right here it's full so that's how you use a vacuum syringe and um, uh, for your continuous ink system